Hello guys, today I wanna show you a cheap and easy way to transform yourself into Jack Skellington from Nightmare Before Christmas. Let's start! First step, I'm applying a primer all over my face, neck and ears. Now with a black eye pencil, I will draw the shape of the head, eyes holes, nose holes and the neck. This is a black face paint stick. But for this makeup you can use whatever black face paint or cream eyeshadow you want. I will be applying it on all the places that need to be black, obviously. If I cannot reach it with the stick, I'm using a brush. Now we'll be setting up the face paint with the black matte eyeshadow. A face paint stick in white, same story as the black one, applying it everywhere when Jack's face and neck is gonna be. I'm setting the white face paint with the white matte eyeshadow. Now I will use a taupe color matte eyeshadow to sculpt the face and the neck. Going over the top color with the white eyeshadow to smooth it out. I'm using the white face paint again and I'm adding more highlights. Using a white eye pencil, I will draw more highlights. I took the white eyeshadow and applying it on the eye surface. I'm making it less flat and boring. I'm blending it with the black eyeshadow. I'm drawing the lines with a black eye pencil. 
I'm correcting the neck with the black stick and the eyeshadow. I'm contouring again with the black eyeshadow. I will use a transparent loose powder to set everything up. I took a black liquid eyeliner and I'm drawing Jack's mouth and teeth. I'm taking a warm grey matte eyeshadow and I will be making the teeth more 3D. With the white eye pencil I'm adding the highlights. And now the last highlights and cleaning using the white face paint and the brush. Setting the face paint with the white eyeshadow. With the Garnier micellar water, a tissue and an ear stick, I will remove the paint from my leaves as it's a bit too much. I'm making the lines tidy with the black eyeliner. And I'm drawing the nose holes. I'm fixing the black color with the black stick. I'm going over the mouth and teeth with the black eyeliner. I will be using a black lipstick now, but you can use a black face paint too.
ready what do you think Here you see the final effect. For the costume I'm wearing a basic striped t-shirt and a black blazer, so I didn't buy anything special. I'm just using whatever I had in my wardrobe. The bow I cut from a black paper and painted white stripes on it. The cat's head I made from plasticine. Painted it black, added white eyes and it was ready. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial, you can also check out the one before, transformation into Emily from the Corpse Bride. Link in the description box down below. Thank you for watching, don't forget to subscribe my channel, like this video and leave a comment. You can also visit me on my social media, Twitter, Facebook and Instagram. I hope to see you next time, bye bye!